Katrin here with European Paper Crafts in the US. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have some fun projects for you, so let's get started. So I made some fun projects here, and the first one I like to share with you is this little booklet that I created for my grandniece's birthday that is coming up. And I used the die cuts and papers from the little meow paper pack that um, I have in my store as a value pack and I'll show it to you in a little while but let me just uh, show you this cute little album that I have created and these are just craft cards and when you open it up you have a little uh, pocket here where I just added a couple of the of, of uh, tags where I can write a little note and then it's like an album then this pretty picture here it is so sweet so now comes the next card and the way I bind them together is I use another piece of craft stock which looks like a V and just glue it to both sides of the, the back of this card and the front of this card and then of course I cover it up with papers but you can still see and this is how I bound the album so there's really nothing to it it's very easy to do it like that way and here I have a little tuck spot with a tag and there's the cute little mouse and I'm gonna write a note there for her here again a pocket with several cute little tags that came in the pack now first we got the kitties drinking the milk we have a happy birthday with cupcakes and this bigger version of it also the kitty with the cupcakes so she can pull these out okay then i have a little tuck spot right here with another tag so super sweet here again a couple pieces in this pocket and I'm thinking I'm probably gonna add a couple of photos because we don't see each other that often so it's nice for her to uh, remember who I am and then here on the uh, last page I added a couple of cards for her that she can give to her friends in her kindergarten so there are and let me just put it down for a minute so I can show you the cards so there are two cards on each side and these are just small little note cards that I rounded the corners to make them look fun and then I added those envelopes that I made with my envelope maker so she has some envelopes and then she can just put her name in there she can write her name already and give it to her friends in her kindergarten and on this side same thing I got two cards and this is how I use up all the pretty papers in the uh, in the pack so, and again, I just have this piece of the V form, and this is how I connect it. Okay, and then here in the end, there's another little pocket right here on this side, cute little kitty, and a tuck spot over here. So this is my album that she will get, and the only way I'm going to keep it together is just with string and of course there's going to be another uh, tag and then in the back I put Fusophy because it, that's her name. Okay, So that's one project that I made. Then I also made a couple of cards that I added into these cute bags and here is one and the way I embellish this here is the strips of paper and this is a great idea to use up all these little strips of paper that we have from our projects and all you need is four strips of paper 
as you can see one two three four you just have to lay them over just like that they come together in the middle you don't see it because you cover up the middle but you leave the open so you only glue it in the middle and then to cover it up you just use something there I had a little heart but on this bag for example I used a button so this is how I used it for this I made a little envelope and the envelope I also added a little tag from the paper pack so there's a little note card that just says love then I have this cute little kitty here also a note card with a matching envelope and the same idea of getting the topper see and then these envelopes then you just fit your card right in here that's why I love the envelope maker so you can make envelopes for the cards that you have and then I made a lot of tags and for my bag with the tags I made this little flower and you can create this with a hard die so if you have a hard die or a hard punch you punch out the heart and then you fold it in the middle and lay it around a circle and this is how you get this flower done again it's a great way to use up scraps so see this is actually a little heart just fold it in the middle and it forms these petals and where you glue it in the middle you kind of cover it up and here I used some bling but I made different tags because this paper pack has all kinds of cute tags so here is one tag and another and another and a tag where I also used the uh, flower again to use up the scripts and I made a tag card so when you open it up you have a little card so these are the tags I made and the cards all from this value pack so there is this uh, little meow it's called from do crafts paper mania in this value pack you get cards six by six cards um, you also get sentiments and you get papers and die cuts and decoupage and all these beautiful cute little kitties so this is uh, a value pack on sale in limited quantities but I wanted to show you how cute the projects are that you can create with them and I have one more project for you and then I have two pocket cards for you that were so much fun to make and they're really easy all you need is a 12 by 12 piece of paper and if you have a 12 or cardstock I should say uh, you can make three of those cards and this is how it works so you basically have your card and when you open it up and look how cute this is I'm going to show you the paper in uh, in a minute but you basically need um, three strips of 4 by 12 so they are 12 inches long like this and then 4 inches wide so you get three cards out of one 12 by 12 cardstock so what you do is you fold it in three so you fold over the four and then the other four you fold back and what you fold back you're going to glue it just the edges so that you create a pocket and that's how it works so look how cute this is so you can then make another pocket if you have extra paper and add maybe a little tag where you can write your note or put a little gift card I really like that as a gift card card you can put a gift card here and then you pull out your tag that fits in the pocket that you created and on that tag I left a little blank here where in the back you can write your note so that's what I call uh, 
a pocket card and then you embellish it just the way you want it. But this is a great way to work with 12 by 12 papers. So again, very easy. You open it up and it is double sided of course the paper. Then you open it up and then the other part you fold back and glue here and you create a pocket where you then can add another piece of paper so that you can have a writing spot. This one you are loved is a stamp that I have a stamp and a die so used it and I left it I didn't color it in because I think it looks okay in this with this type of paper. Here to add a little uh, color on the other card I just added some uh, pretty flowers that I also punched with my flower punch and these these uh, uh, little flags here is a punch that I I really try to use up all my scraps so that I don't have too much left over but what I used here are these craft sheets by Kanban and that I have two so here is the one that I used for this project the craft sheets are 12 inches by 16.5 inches, 16 and a half inches. This one here, when you take it out, and I will show this to you so it makes sense. Uh, let me see. So you take this one out, and you have one craft sheet in here that then folds out like this, right? So you have the 12 by 12 paper and then you also have this part with your die cuts. And you got the flowers and you got the little owls. And this is like really a uh, heavy card stock. So it is on uh, in my store, these craft sheets. And here is another one. And this one here has the cute owls and cute little birdies on a double-sided sheet. So this would also make very cute um, pocket cards because of the cardstock that is quite heavy. And these are die cuts, so the, the uh, owl, you can just take it out, the little birdies here. You can I don't know if it's an owl or not, it looks like it. Um, you can just uh, push them out and then use them as tags or use them to embellish your little booklets. But aren't they cute and they're so, so handy. So they're four by four. And so that you have perfect envelopes for these cards because with this tag it will stick out. So it's not a perfect four by four, but it comes out with this um, little pull out I used the flower for the pull out um, what you can do is you make yourself some envelopes with your envelope maker so that you always have the perfect envelope and what you can do is just use regular white cardstock and then you have a beautiful white envelope for your tag card so I hope you like my cards and tags if so please give me a thumbs up leave me a comment and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet i would love to have you in my crafting family also join me on facebook under european paper crafts facebook friends all the information is in the info box below this is all i have for you today please stay or get well and let us be kind to each other thank you so much and i'll catch you next time bye